Get it. Dr. Whitaker, I haven't seen you in two years, man. For those of you, those of us who don't know you, I know you. Who is Dr. Whitaker and talk about your book, Medicine? Dr. Whitaker is a naturopathic doctor with over 20 years experience in herbology, detoxification, natural healing. Traveled over the world studying uh, Asia, Africa, and brought those sciences back here to America to hopefully hope America solve its disease problem. My book, Medicine, is a culmination of 12 years of research where I discussed the uh, medical sins being caused against humanity and particularly the African American community. And you, and you, in your book, Medicine, you break down the inception of the pharmaceutical business. Explain that to the people. Yeah, the pharmaceutical industry came about uh, big time through IG Farben, which was a German chemical plant uh, which produces nothing but chemicals. So those chemicals need a market. So the market was the drug industry. And so today, all the medical schools know nothing about nutrition. All they know about is prescribing drugs and surgery. And that's, just, that's basically it. Now you are a doctor. Now explain um, uh, what type of, you're not a naturopathic doctor, but what does that mean for those of us who don't know? Naturopathic doctor are the original healers. We, uh, it goes back to the time of Adam, that when we use the plants for healing, as stated in both biblical uh, and Quranic verses, to use the plants for healing. And uh, the, the naturopathic doctor is one who uses uh, detoxification, water therapy, all types of systems of the natural environment to heal the body and get it back into balance. Now, we have seen uh, the financial system just collapse here in the United States. Now, when the medical system collapses because the costs are going too high, it's going to collapse too. When the medical system here in the States collapses, will they embrace doctors such as yourself? Well, really, the medical system has no choice but to embrace natural medicine. The uh, current medical paradigm that we're under today will not cure any disease, it's not designed to cure any disease, it's only there to manage your disease. That's why they call it health care management. It's an HMO, managing your disease. So that's basically what it's all about, managing your disease. Now the bottom line is that, if that's for those of us like me, uh, last time I saw you, my blood pressure was high. Now you got some high, they put me in a little mild diuretic because I eat the cookies, I eat the junk food. Let's, let's break it down. Those of us who have high blood pressure, after we see our doctor and we come see a person, a naturopathic doctor like you, what should we do? Well, number one... High blood pressure. High blood pressure. Number one, once you make, make the, the declaration that you want to get well, that's your first thing. Number two, eliminate those things that are causing the problem. Number one is uh, refined sugar. Number two is uh, margarine. Those are the two things that are causing the high blood pressure, heart attacks, and strokes. What we implement then is fresh fruits, fresh and vegetables. We can implement uh, oils and fresh fats like uh, flaxseed oil, cod liver oil. Herbal wise, we can do hearthorn berries, garlic, the ginger, all those things lower blood pressure. Well, we need to come see, so we get, can't be going to Walmart doing us some health food stuff. We really need somebody like you to walk us through this process. Yeah, I can give you a uh, guideline protocol. Uh -huh. uh, of course, my book, Medicine, will be a, a valuable asset. But, uh, and, and you have to buy these things at, 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 at uh, high quality. High be, quality. You can't be going to Walgreens and getting garlic saying, oh, you know, and then saying it don't work. Well, of course, the $2.99 is not going to work. <laughs> you need to be eating fresh garlic anyway in your food. So, fresh garlic. Uh, and fresh ginger. So th those are the things that we need to do. Let's go quickly. Diabetes. What should we do? Diabetes. Immediately eliminate all refined carbohydrates. White flour, white bread, uh, white, sh uh, white sugar. And you need to implement chromium in your diet. Chromium. You supplement it, uh, 300 micrograms of chromium, GTF, and then one tablespoon of cod liver oil. Eliminate diabetes in six weeks. Six weeks? Six weeks, no doubt. But like, I'm going to talk to you off the air, okay? <laughs> and I think our audience should talk to you off the air. Uh, you say kidney failure is huge. Kidney failure, explain that. Yeah, kidney failure. I've labeled the uh, kidney dialysis machine as basically the nigger machine. And uh, basically 85% of the people on them is African Americans. It's one of the main causes is these uh, uh, Tylenols and Advils and Motrin. So the main cause of kidney failure. What? 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 what the Tylenol and Advil? Tylenol. Matter of fact, acetaminophen and ibuprofen. Right. Wow. Yeah. The FDA this year now uh, just put on the package now, uh, and warning causes kidney failure. Wait, 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 wait. I take, I take, I take, a, uh, I take a ibuprofen all the time, man. What should I do when I have a headache, man? A headache, you can use Feverfew. The okay. Herb fever few. But my today my back hurt. I take about three iron probes because my neck and my back is hurting today, man. Uh, massage therapy. Well, I need somebody to massage me for some therapy. That's for sure. 
What's the main, like, what do you see all the time? We're almost done. What is the main thing when you uh, go across the country, you meet so many people, what are you really, what are you telling them? What are you lecturing about? Uh, I talk about so many things. Uh, what's, the, what's the main problem people have? Is it cancer, diabetes, oh, high blood pressure? What is it? The big three are basically uh, diabetes, uh, high blood, and so much kidney failure. And kidney failure, I didn't know that. Oh yeah, kidney failure. And, and you, but but do you, okay, when you do you have warning signs of kidney failure? Oh yeah, well, right when you, when you have high blood pressure, that's that's all kidneys because the kidneys regulate the pressure in the body, and uh, you, you'll notice that also people say oh, I will have low back pain. Actually, it's actually the kidneys. So uh, kidney failure is rampant. Like as I mentioned earlier, the the uh, NIGA machine, which is basically the kidney dialysis machine is 85% used by African Americans. But so, I mean, genetically, African Americans shouldn't shouldn't eat the, uh, the American diet then? No, well, anybody shouldn't. But particularly us, we are definitely affected by it on, a, on another scale. Okay, so I'm almost done. We've we, we done six and a half minutes. What do you do? You're so thin and handsome. What do you eat in the morning? And what do you eat in the noon and lunchtime? What do you eat at night? <laughs> well, in the morning, I make my own uh, so-called smoothies. I use blueberry, strawberry, uh, mango, a little uh, fresh squeezed apple juice, mix it together, I throw my little extra herbal uh, remedies in there, and drink that. For lunch, a big green salad. Uh, if, I, if, I, if, I, if I venture out to want to get some uh, fish or anything like that to add with it. And then uh, basically my, my, my uh, evening meal is basically, uh, it could be brown rice, uh, beans, uh, or uh, grilled, something grilled on, on, on the grill. Uh, maybe a little lamb chop. Of course, organic, grass-fed, and uh, always something green. Anytime you eat meat, you need to have something green with it. Okay. Do, do you go to? Do you eat fat, fried fast foods? No. Do you eat uh, cookies with a lot of sugar, white sugar in it? No. If, if I make, if I want to eat cookies, I make them myself, and I, I, I put uh, raw sugar in the cookie instead of refined white sugar. Wow, and you said butter's better than margarine. Butter any day over than margarine. Other than margarine. Okay, you gotta close the comment because see, people, they got mad at me last time I did an interview because it wasn't fast enough. But give you give some information. They want to see you, just go to the website, right? Oh yeah, website, www.medicines.net, M-E-D-I-S-I-N-S dot net. Uh, just to close out, uh, people, you have to take your health into your own hands. You're not gonna have any solution coming from your HMO, PPO. It does not exist. The whole game is to keep you sick so they can manage your disease and, and, and keep uh, 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 breaking you at the bank account because 50% of all bankruptcies are from medical costs. Wow, so a person like me, that means I, I gotta lay off the white sugar. I love white sugar because I like cookies. And I love fast food. It's hard for me to break that. that, that the the, the drive-thru is open 24 hours. I gotta stop eating that fried food and stuff, huh? If you wanna obtain optimal health, those things will have to be eliminated. And you think, I, and I can drop 20 pounds and, and, and lower my high blood pressure? No doubt about it. Oh, how long is it gonna take? It'll take you uh, But it's a, it's a lifestyle change. That's what it's about, right? There's no doubt about it. It's oh. a lifestyle. Not a one-time thing, oh, and then get back on it three months from now, and then hop back on the sugar and the white flour. It's a total lifestyle change. Wow. Okay, let's talk off the air, man. <laughs> Dr. Whitaker.